All right, Canadians, we are back. It's time to continue our Canadian civilization. That's right. Last video, we ended it on making open borders with pretty much every other civilization that uh, is out here. Hang on, let me just add these back in there. Uh, we have open borders now with Constantinople, uh, Greece, and Persia. I think those are the only three. Yeah, we're friendly with all of them. We've made peace with everyone. All right, so uh, what we've done with our triremes, we're sending them out to explore the coastal cities because now we can go through their, uh, their territory so we can explore all of this. And I was reading your comments and you guys were saying that we need a few land scouts as well so that we can uh, uncover all of this fog of war as well. And that's a good idea. So we'll get on some scouts after we get these workshops done in Montreal, Toronto, and uh, Ottawa. And uh, for our next social policy, you guys were saying go after commerce because not only does it help... Uh, um, a naval empire, which we are going to be with all these coastal cities and eventually Constantinople. We are still keeping our eyes on that. And it also helps out with gold, which always helps a bigger empire, okay? So that's what we're going to go after, commerce. Very nicely done. All right, so we're up to 23 gold per turn. I'm um, still just uh, building up some workshops. We're completely at peace with everyone. We're in the middle of uh, getting our workers and our, not our, not our workers, our military unit back into Toronto so that it's ready to go and we need it again. I'd say right now what we need is a few more workers. We have uh, four workers building right now, which isn't bad, but I want to get that uh, road from Montreal to Adrianople done as well as um, these luxury resources and just the regular resources. Like Ottawa would help out a lot more if they had mines built right here. I could manually do it, but uh, I left the... Uh, workers on automated just for right now just to see what they do all right um yeah so let's go and we actually have another worker coming in one turn anyway so that's perfect so let's just continue it here let's go next turn yeah you see our military is coming back no you can stay right there uh catapult you can stay actually I'll just bring these guys all back into the same road all right yep and let's go next turn so let's keep an eye on the uh the greeks i'd say the greeks are the most powerful uh, neighbor that we have right now. I mean, Songhai, or no, not Songhai, it's actually Persia. Persia has been dwindled down to one city that's not even their own city. It is a capital, but it was Songhai's old capital. And Constantinople, we took uh, Adrianople, and not only that, we kind of hemmed them in right here. I think they have a third city up here, or a second city now, but uh, we'll see eventually. All right, Terracotta Army has been built in a land far away. Yep. Uh, okay, so we finished the worker in Toronto. Do we have the workshop done in Toronto yet? I think we do. Yeah, I think we do. Uh, so let's just keep on building what we said we were going to want to build, the uh, scouts and the workers. All right, so we'll get a scout going. Uh, catapults, you're going to stay put. Uh, worker, automated. All right, just get going on some, like there's another mine that could be built right here. We need a road going from here to here. It'll come eventually. It'll come eventually, okay? Uh, the more workers that we have, the quicker it'll get done. That's why I want workers. But we need scouts as well. I'm thinking three scouts should be enough. It's not really a big land uh, territory that we're on. Doesn't look too big, anyways. Don Cherry, get back down here, son. We gotta keep you alive. You were the one who took Adrian Opal. Gotta keep Don Cherry alive. All right. Yeah, religion enhanced. Okay, so Byzantium has a pretty strong religion here in Constantinople, but we're gonna have to deal with that. Competing religions just can't deal with it right now, though. All right. Uh, all right. So we got another scout. Let's give him uh, one plus visibility range. All right. He can unlock more that way. Uh, explore yourself, son. Get out there. So that scout's just gonna go out and explore by himself. Uh, you... Oh, look at this trireme. He's kind of stuck in from all these dromans. Uh, stay put for right now. There you go. Alright. Uh, we got the workshop done in Montreal. Let's get going on a, another... Yeah, let's just get the, the units that I want built first, and then we'll go back to the buildings. I want scouts, and I want workers. Another scout. We'll have three done from this way. Yeah, and then we can go uh, one worker for Montreal, one worker for Toronto, and that should give us six workers. That'll be more than enough. All right, so yeah, you're going to get back on this road right here, Spearman. Yeah, we desperately need that road going from Montreal to Adrianople. I'll get that done eventually. Next turn. All right, yeah, see all these workers, they're still just working on the uh, territories that are around Toronto, which is fine because they've pretty much done, done them all after these two. So that'll be good. Once they move on to Ottawa, I really need some in Ottawa after this. I need these two tiles built up. All right, unit promotion, visibility range again for this uh, scout. There you go. Spearman, you're going to come right here. Fortify yourself. Uh, you, Trireme, keep on moving up. There you go. Keep on moving around. There you go. So he made it all the way up this way. You, you got to get around this way as well. I got to make sure I'll, I'll manually do that for him. Uh, scouts, and another scout. I'll get one more scout, so we'll have four scouts, okay? 
That'll get that. I'll delete the scouts as soon as uh, they've unlocked everything. But uh, let's just get everything unlocked as soon as we can. As soon as possible. All right. So, yeah. Next turn. Let's see what happens. Uh, declaration of friendship with Byzantium. No. Sorry. We would like to go by ourselves. Eventually, I do want to take Constantinople. And you know what? They declared war on us first. So, I'm not prepared to make friends with them. They didn't want to be friends in the first part. So, screw them, man. They don't get to be friends with the Canadians. All right. No way. No how. Philosophy. All right. So, Adrianople has also grown to four citizens. That's good. All right. Another scout has been completed. One plus vis visibility. Explore. Another scout's been done. All right. So, we got four scouts going throughout the uh, the land. Going to take care of all this fog of war right here. Okay. Next on the list, we need workers. Seven turns for a worker in Montreal. That's actually a little bit too much. Yeah. Let's get going on some buildings. Montreal, let's get going on that uh, granary. Yeah, let's get a granary done in every one of our cities. Toronto, I could use a granary, but let's go after that other worker right now. Because Toronto has the better production. We'll get another worker done. Uh, Trireem, explore. Oh, you see what I mean? It doesn't just end right there. It does go up to a whole other part of a continent now. So Adrianople does still have some land to go and settle on. Alright, you're going to come this way. You got to stay put for right now. Yeah. See it. Next turn. Yeah, the scouts are still going out. Watch them all move. Come on now, scouts. They should get a bunch of this uh, fog of war done right now. This guy, anyways. When he finally moves. What's going on up here? Oh, it looks like uh, Songhai is being attacked by Greece. See, the bar is down to... Yeah. Oh, well, gotta leave it. Gotta leave it. Can't uh, get uh, caught up in that. Can't get caught up in that. Uh, you, move up here. Move up. Oh, yeah, you can go right over here, son. There you go. Yeah, stay right there. Uh, Greece announced to the world is now protecting Geneva. Uh, you've accumulated enough faith to purchase a unit or building. Do I want another... Uh, do I already have a uh, updated religion? Hang on. Number of cities, my religion. Let's see. No, I, I need to enhance my religion still. So, Great Prophet is next on the list still. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you gotta stay put right there. Okay, I'm just trying to think, should I send a unit up here, like a Don Cherry unit, just to take out, you know what, I'm just going to try this, hang on a sec. You, move up here, you, move up here, and you, move up here. Let's just try something out here. We may be missing out on something that we can quickly just snag up that city, if we get it, uh, if we do this the right way. And Composite Bowman, why not you come over here as well. Alright, yeah, there you go. And I'll bring the Great General, he'll, he'll help as well, might as well. Don't need the other, other catapult, though. There you go, great general. Move on up. Very nice. Next turn. Because if we can get a unit there and it's almost dead, then we can steal that city before Greeks do. Because, I mean, yeah, it'd be kind of... Uh, we'd have to declare, redeclare war on Persia, but it looks like Greece is going to become very powerful if we allow them to get another city. I mean, they'd have three capitals. They'd have Persepolis, uh, Songhai, and Athens, where we only have one capital. We didn't even take Constantinople yet, so they have three very powerful cities. We found a natural wonder, the Great Barrier Reef. So that's good. Uh, Alright, so we can now, uh, Theodora can now declare war, war on us once again. We're no longer uh, stricken to a peace treaty. Alright, explore. There you go. This guy's going around there. So that's where the continent kind of ends, right up here with another city state. Okay, so that's, uh, we're going to get in a better uh, grasp of this whole area. These two guys are uh, scouting down here for us. Well, we have this trireme going down here as well. So we're starting to get our continent a little bit more. Uh, Uncovered, I guess you could say. But look, they're uh, look the Greeks are starting to trap in Songhai, so I don't know if we're going to be able to steal it from them. Let's just try it out, though. Get up there, get over there, get over there, and you sure get over there. All right, great general, you come on up here. Next turn, let's see what happens. We got another worker coming in, which will be great. I think they may be starting to build a road here. I could be wrong. We'll have to see what they do. I could manually do it, but let's just. I want the workers to, like, they're doing stuff that they feel is priority is better. Like, the sugar resource would be good, because that'll get us an extra gold per turn. I can sell that. Alright. And what is this guy building? He is building a road. So they're already starting to build the road to Adrianople. Okay, so we're good. Alright. Uh, you. Come on down here. Yeah, I'm going to have to move you if I'm going to attack with this guy. I can move him down here. He can attack from down here. So can this guy. Yeah, but maybe I'll move the spearman up there. Maybe he could sneak in. All right. Yep. Uh, finish the worker. Let's get going on one last worker from Toronto. All right. Automated. 
Yeah, that'll be enough workers after that. Yeah, that'll be enough. Next turn, let's see what happens over here, Songhai. Yeah, they're hitting it. See, they're hitting it. We may be able to sneak in there and steal it with our spearmen. If I time it the right way, we may be able to sneak one in here. Hang on. See if I get lucky. Mombasa looks elsewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on now. All right. You, you're going to... Yeah, look, they even have... They have everything blocked off from us this from this side. It's not going to be a piece of cake. All right, you're going to come up right there. You... Right in here. Don Cherry. You right over there. And Great General right over here. I'm hoping that maybe one of these units die and we can sneak up. Or if I can get the Spearman up to this tile. But if they have it completely blocked in, I'm not even going to help uh, destroy the city. There's no there's no point. Alright, unit needs orders. Yeah, you stay put right there, Don. Next turn. Let's see what happens. Yeah, see they're attacking you. They have it like surrounded. Yeah, there's no... I think they pretty much steal the city. Yeah, they're hitting with three comps of Bowman. Now they're hitting... Well, here's the thing. Those are going to really get hurt. And if they decide to bombard those knights... Oof. This city's going to fall. Yeah, they got to completely surround it. There's no way. Oh, my God. They're probably going to take it this turn. It's like a six... It's like a seven-man attack. Eight-man attack. Yeah, they took it. They took it. There's no way we were going to be able to sneak over there and steal it back. All right, so Greece, a very big superpower to this world right now. All right, Greece has their third capital city. And look at all this, yeah. And they got the Great Wall. They got Persepolis. I think they have another city right here because the Great... Yeah, Pas... Oh, Jesus. They got a lot of cities, the Greeks, all right? But, again, we're not ready to declare war on them. We could lose that battle. They got knights and spikemen. So we got to move back, boys. Move back. All right, get back, get back, get back. That's fine. I just wanted to test it out. But I think we all know who's next on their list. You know what I mean? If they are that kind of civilization. So we need to refocus on military units. Absolutely. Uh, we finished the granary right over here. That's good. Uh, walls. I'm just trying to think. What would we need to help out our civilization? Amphitheater for culture. I don't really need culture right now. Barracks wouldn't be bad. Temple wouldn't be bad. Walls to protect ourselves. Yeah, you know what? Let me go for walls because it's... I'm going to need walls for Constantinople and, uh, yeah, we need defensive buildings and military units right now. And we need to get our education. Yeah, we need to get education. Yeah, all right. So we know what we have to do still. All right, so, yep. We need to start building some more military units with uh, Toronto now. Think defensive units like Composite Bowman. It's come to my attention that a large number of your units are near my borders. I request that you move them elsewhere to avoid causing undue distress to my citizens. The citizens of Songhai, which are uh, from Persia, you take it's the capital has been taken over twice, man. We mean no harm. Our units are merely passing through the area. Yeah, calm down, son. So it's our friggin' scouts that are near your friggin' borders. Calm your ass, all right? Yeah, it's like because we have two scouts near their uh, borders. Calm down. All right, we're we're, we're backing off. Who are you to who are you to get mad at people? You're the one friggin' declaring war on everyone. Taking their cities from them. Good God. Alright, so theology. My city's been converted. Yeah, you see what I mean? Um, Byzantium has got a pretty strong religion coming down here. That's okay, though. I mean, we can deal with it. We can deal with it. Uh, once we take uh, Constantinople, which may not happen anytime soon, we can deal with religion. Um, but religion's not the, like, it's not the end-all, be-all. If we're not going to be religious, that's okay. Get back here. Get back here. Come on back, everybody. Got to get you all back home and safe. All right, so we finished a worker in Toronto. Yeah, I don't need a granary in Toronto. But I want to go after a oracle or a, war, uh, no, or a wonder, sorry. National College might not be a bad idea. You know what? Let me go after the National College because it's a science boost and every, every civilization can build their own. And uh, yeah, I could use that. You guys were saying that we need to go on science anyway. So let's get that done and then we'll go after the military units. All right. Uh, worker automated. Very nice. And that's enough scouts and worker units for now. Okay. Next turn. Yeah. Hopefully we have some time to uh, look. They got so many mil military units over here. We got to really defend ourselves. Yeah, we got to start building military units. No doubt about it. Look at all those units. They got composite bowmen, swordsmen, pikemen, and uh, uh, knights. All right. Education's coming for us in 12 turns, which will be nice. But still, we just got to make sure we watch out for these guys. And we got a golden age. That's good. We got a golden age that has dawned. So that'll help our gold per turn and our production. Very nice. Uh, ooh, we, fa we found Krakatoa. That's another wonder. So that'll help our happiness. Very nice. Unit needs orders. You guys, get back. Get back. Comps of Bowman, get back. There you go. They're almost back home. Uh, great General, you're going to get back as well. 
Very nice. Still just building up. See what they mean? The workers are getting that road done right now. That road's going to get completed at uh, Adrianople right as we speak, which is perfect. Next turn. Uh, Theodora has completed the Machu Picchu, so Theodora is completing a lot of wonders right here. Okay, so Constantinople is definitely a city that we want to take, but we have to um, upgrade or uh, outclass their navy units, basically, if we want any chance to take out Constantinople, all right? It's, uh, that city is going to be taken from navy, definitely. Uh, all right, unit needs orders. Don Cherry, get back home. So, uh, you get back home, and you get back home. Very nice. Spearman over here. And actually, I can upgrade this Spearman. Might as well do it right now, in, ca in case war happens. All right, you're going to stay right there. Great General, back in the city. Warrior unit. I can't upgrade him because I don't have any iron, but that's okay. Don't need the iron for right now. You're going to stay put right there. You're going to stay put. Catapult, you're going to stay put. When I can get you to trebuchets, I will. We just got to make sure to keep an eye out for the Greek, uh, the Greek civilization now. As soon as we see units marching on our borders, we know that they're declaring war. All right, so next turn. Let's see what happens here. What's going on? Oh, that's uh, Adrianople. Not, not Adrianople. That's the uh, Byzantium's attacking uh, Barbarian. So that's okay. That wasn't us. So this trireme got through, so he's going to be able to uh, discover this side now, which is great for us. Our scouts are really doing a good job. Look how much of the uh, continent we have uncovered now. You can see how strong the Greeks are really becoming. They have a lot of open area that they can go after. Uh, yeah, just keep on exploring. Keep on exploring. There you go. Yeah, see, look at all the cities that the Greeks have. Athens, right up here by itself. Sparta, Corinth, Persepolis, Pasargades, Gao. There's a whole other area down here for another city that they have the rights to basically that's a far away city for me to spawn another one and it looks like up here is up for uh, constantinople so i think uh the best way to take out greece would be an attack right now because it looks like uh all four of us well actually there was more than four it was perspoli songhai greece us and uh, byzantium we all spawned on this one continent now it's down to three all right so greeks are pretty I don't know. we got to watch out for the Greeks. We really do have to watch out for the Greeks. If they're that kind of civilization. So Montreal, what do we want to do? Let's get uh, going on those barracks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can, Actually, you know what? We don't need... No, nah, we don't need to do that. Let's just get going on the military units themselves. All right. Cobb is a bowman. We need ourselves... We need uh, defense right now. We need uh, units that can defend our cities. You're going to stay put right there, Don Cherry. You're going to stay put right there. Catapults, you're going to come right up here. Stay put as well. Very nice. And let's do one more turn just so we can get this workshop done in Ottawa. All right, our golden... Oh, look at this. Look at this. Now, they could be moving up towards... Uh, what's it called? Byzantium. They could be doing that. All right, but it looks like they are marching towards Adrianople. If I was to put bets on it, they've already proven that they are that kind of civilization. Adrianople is in trouble, okay? Now, we do have enough uh, money that we can quickly purchase Compass of Bowman. All right, we can quickly purchase two of them. And this road is going to be done in no time at all. So we can quickly purchase one here, one here, and move them into position. That won't be a problem, all right? But remember, they do have a lot of units, so we would have to get uh, building a lot of composite bowmen and start to shift them up here okay so yeah we're gonna end the uh the turn right here because it seems like a lot is going on right now so in ottawa we got that workshop done so let's go in after let's go after some composite bowmen all right we need a lot more national college is being built in toronto so that'll boost our science along with education which is done in eight turns so we can get that national college and then universities done hopefully that'll help out our science all right catch up to the greeks and uh, hopefully the Greeks don't attack us, but it does look like they are, right? So, Canadians, where should we go from here? Seems like uh, we have a lot of workers that we can delete if we need to save up some money. But for right now, they're getting all these resources done, building the roads, which we need. All right, our scouts, we can delete as well once they have... Uh, um, pretty much the continent explored, which they do already, and I can also delete the trireme, so we can still delete a lot of units, which can save up a lot of more, a lot more money in which we can spend in military units, because I think as soon as Greece, if they do declare war on us, I think we shouldn't make peace, I think we should focus on building up a military, and counter-attacking them, and pushing them back to at least pass our gay day, you know, take at least Songhai, Gao, um, so at least the continent is split in half and we have two capitals compared to their two capitals I think we should definitely do that. All right, but Canadians I will put it to you PM superb man need some help because it looks like the enemies are at the gates one more time That's right boys. So I will see you in the next video